At the H2O building, I am back. I know I've been avoiding a lot of the traffic going from New York to New Jersey, so that's where I have been, but we're back. We're back. I'm so excited. This card is banger alert, so make sure you watch it if you didn't watch it and you're watching this video. So, all right, well, I'm gonna get you some uh, interviews, so. So it's been a minute since we've seen Ryan Redfield. How are you? It's been a minute indeed. I know. So like, there's so much catching up we got to do. Like, we there is so many video games of the week. <laughs> so, give us your video game of the week. Uh, there's so much. There's so much uh, to come up. But you know what? In honor of one of my uh, favorite Marvel characters, who's also getting uh, his own game coming out, which. I don't know if it's going to be out until 2024, I think, but might as well go with the X-Men Origins Wolverine game because it makes you feel like Wolverine, and it's much better than that terrible movie. I thought you were going to give us, like, a WWE game because of your shirt. <laughs> Okay, you, I'll, let's do two then. Let's okay, two. well, because it's been a while, so we can give us another one. All right, and as for a WWE game, SmackDown vs. Raw 2007. <laughs> the game is very amazing, and... Oh, wow. Man, so many good memories with it. Awesome. So we're back for the Sean Henderson show today, and you're wrestling Tara Caraway. So. Well, possibly now. I'm not sure if I am anymore. Oh no. Uh, or because yeah, Sean hit me up yesterday that her back has been like bothering her. So um, if I'm not wrestling Tara Caraway today, then I might be wrestling Gigi Everson if he's here. Ooh. Okay. Okay. So we gotta stay tuned, and this is why you need to watch H2O. So good luck to you. I am I'm telling Sean now about how that the last time one of the last times that I was here is that we were plugging Christmas balls on the doors and there was a whole thing going on. So I'm kinda upset right now that there's no balls. I, going I, on I, the I door. struggled so hard with my ball handleage last time that I don't think I can control any more <laughs> ball handleage. So it's just plain doors today. Oh, just plain uh, doors today. Just, just, let's, just, let's just say it was a struggle because like every time the balls were taped to the yeah. wall. Yeah, they, they kept, fell off. They kept falling off. I I, I'm still sorry to, about, to this day about this. I accidentally knocked into one and then they yeah. all start and they yeah. just all avalanche. So then I have yeah. to redo my balls again. <laughs> of course. So no more ball struggles. No more balls. I don't want to struggle with my no balls. More balls. balls. No more balls. Balls, balls. balls that can't stick to balls. No, it's a bummer. It's a bummer. It really truly really is. We're yeah, building yeah. the side. Hello, I'm Sean <laughs> and I'm building stuff. <laughs> Sean the builder. I am. Yes, he can. <laughs> what are you building? Some that's gonna hurt for Bam and Kirk. Well, that, that totally makes sense. <laughs> I saw this in a Tangled Web match from like five years ago and I always thought it looked cool. And like no one did it since. I was like, fuck it, I'm gonna I love uh, the inspiration that happened. Oh, heck yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I like Austin too. Austin's got another brain for it. He does, he does. On my regular pod, which we're gonna make happen, obviously yes. we gotta do it under the ropes because I've been talking. And you actually come up a lot on my podcast, so I need to make that happen. So we're gonna yes. make that happen. We're awesome. gonna make it. We're gonna make a formal interview oh, happen yeah. real soon or whatever. Oh, it's yeah. like there's so many people, but so today you're wrestling Marcus Matters. We saw a bunch of promos coming from you. We saw some from Marcus. So we're getting ready today. So how are you preparing? I've been like honestly doing the most cardio I've ever had. Honestly, like jump rope, doing burpees, going for runs, just. I know Mark, so I don't want to bring it today. He's going to kill it. He's going to do a bunch of stupid shit. <laughs> and I got to be ready to deliver, so. I know, I know. And it's hot, and I know that's, like, so a big hot. thing that everybody actually says, like, and we yes. were talking about it off cab. Like, how do you deal with that, like, wrestling, like, pacing, you know, in the ring, right. working someone like Marcus? Yeah, he's, uh, he's going to definitely want to go crazy. I mean, I work more of like a slower pace, but, uh, yeah, I mean... Listen, it's a big test for me today. I got to deliver. Yes. And I feel like every time I've been put in a situation where I have to kill it, I feel like I've done a good job of that, and I'm trying to just keep the momentum going, honestly. Yeah, so I, I'm glad, like, I get to see you, like, a lot on the Sean Henderson cards. I'd like to see more of you, <laughs> like, obviously. Yes. So, But I'm so glad. So if you guys are not following Ryan, please follow him. So. Yes, I would, love to, I would love to wrestle more companies. It's just hard with, like, my autoimmune disorder. Yeah. It's hard to... Like, I used to do it when I was younger. Like, when I was younger, I could wrestle 
three times a week right. and not feel any pain. And nowadays it's like, oh, my joints hurt, my back yeah. hurts, my head hurts. So, I get it. Uh, yeah, it's SHP exclusive for now, but if H2O ever wanted to bring me back, I'd be more than happy to do so. Well, stay tuned, guys. Yes. We'll hope so. So thank you. Good luck. So you got a big match today. Are you ready? I do. I'm very ready. You ready? This is a dream match, too. That Sean, uh, Sean made happen, too. My personal dream match, yes. So really excited. So everybody should be watching this. And he's got merch, right? We give him shit. I give him a lot of shit. Give him merch. shit. But he's got merch. So you so come bother him. <laughs> <laughs> I put him on the spot. I put him on the spot. So. I have merch now. Can you tell him the surprise though? What else you got? Ooh, we got a surprise? Oh, we also yeah. What do we got? I'm debuting new gear today. Are you really? Yay! Oh, that's exciting. I'm excited. Well, technically, I guess I wore it last night on another show, but. Mm -hmm. Well, I didn't see it, so it's new. Shut up. Shut up. It did happen. New gear We're debuting you. in H2O Building. How about yes. that? Yes. So, oh, I'm excited. New gear since my literal first set of gear ever. So. Yes. It's been a minute, so. Two years, I'm really, it's been a minute. Is it? Right. It's been a minute. I'm like, I'm like, what is he getting? Everybody's getting like new gear, and it's yeah. like, okay. You're wondering no. what he's doing. <laughs> I'm just the laziest wrestler of all time. <laughs> <laughs> Don't say that. Book me. <laughs> Book me. <laughs> well, I'm not lazy anymore. <laughs> Good. Not lazy anymore. I have merch and new gear now. Merch and new gear. We're, we're moving on up. So, and then, and then he debuted our wrestling open, which I was really excited for. And I'm sad I didn't come yeah, up. Yeah, I hope they so. bring me back soon. Huh? I hope they bring me back soon. Yeah, I, I like know. Them. Like, um, who was it? Somebody was telling me that Drew wants like a bunch of the H two O kits. Yeah. So, but I was really excited, and I know I sent a fan your way. Um, that was like, I was like, Dylan's my favorite. Go, go bother him. So oh, yeah. like, <laughs> I don't know if they told me who. No, he did. He oh, said he did because he said, okay, he said that he remember. met you because he messaged me after. Okay. And he was like, he's like, oh, he's so nice. He's like, I told you. <laughs> <laughs> see, I'm gonna, yeah. see, I'm see, I make moves everywhere I go. So like. If I'm not there, I send somebody yeah, my I'm way. You weren't there. That's like I know I was right? going to. Yeah, I wanted. I forgot why. Are you at all the wrestling opens? No. 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 Go up to all the wrestling opens. <laughs> it's like three hours from there, so it's worse than here. But was that the week that I went up? No. It was the week after I came back from Miami. That's why, because I was broke uh, <laughs> from Miami. <laughs> <laughs> so, anyway, good luck today. Thank you so much. Oh, I, I know I gave you shit the other day. <laughs> all right. Well, first of all, last congratulations day. because you went up to C4, yeah. which is a massive bucket list for a lot of wrestlers that come onto my podcast that they talk about it. So, totally this, know that. huge. So, that's why I say, like, congratulations. Yeah, I was very fortunate to get that opportunity. I, I promise you that. I was so excited. I was so excited for you. I get so excited when everybody, like, gets opportunities all over the place. So, but um, I forgot my white marker so that I could put the little dots in your pants. Yeah. Because you know he's dressed up as Brandon. You, know, you want to know something funny? When I went up there, ain't nobody say that I dressed like Brandon Curry. It was just you down here. It's just saying. It's the things that I like that stick out to me. And I saw the shirt, and I'm like, wait a minute. I was like, I see that with Brandon all the time. And then I was like, and then the black pants. And I'm like, all right, let me get my white marker and let me put the dots on the pants. So I, I wouldn't call it me trying to steal this. No, uh, I know it was, it was supposed to be funny. Inspiration. It was. It was. It was just funny. I just. I had a best with you. Right. So, but this Watch exciting. tonight. I'm going to come out with a blonde Brandy Kirkwood. <laughs> I'm really inspired now. <laughs> now it has to be a Halloween match. The Halloween show. You versus Brandon. Yeah. <laughs> so that's so awesome. Yeah, I was always wondering if he likes me or not. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe. Where is okay. We're, we're going to have to ask him. I don't, we're going to have to ask him. victim here. Right, we've been talking about it on the podcast a lot, so we're saying that obviously perfect bridge, right? There's so many people. We were talking about with Nick Wayne the other day, he was on the podcast. Um, so I told him that he's got to give me, you know, a tutorial, but we have you here now, so you're gonna give me the tutorial. So, why is it the perfect bridge? Because it's toast. So, well, you know, there's a lot of technique that goes into it, there's a lot of uh ability that goes into it, but a lot of strength that goes into it, yeah. a lot of, uh, you know, physical work, exercise, all that kind of stuff, mm -hmm. but, and I know this will help fellow wrestlers as well, yeah. it's all just in the upper body, it's literally all just in, up in the upper body strength, so, this is usually what I do if I'm practicing bridges during the week, I'm not wrestling, what I'll do is, get on my knees, mm -hmm. stretch out a little bit, a little bit, get the upper body loose, you know, you can go do one of these, That'll help. That'll crack your back a little bit to get you ready. Um, you know, do that a little bit. Loosen up the neck. Make sure you're not too tight. Cause you know, neck injuries are a very real thing. So, we're gonna jump right in. Right. 
Bridge! Look at that bridge! Jesus Christ! <laughs> you, you can just hold that for about maybe like 30 to 60 seconds. You're okay. But the trick is, don't use your hands. You want to kind of just be like this. You kind of just want to flow. You kind of just want to use that upper body strength to guide you. To guide yourself. Roll around a little bit. Look at that. Perfect bridge. Roll around, roll around. And then when you're ready, you go. Jesus. Good arch, man. That's what it's all about. <laughs> get y'all warmed up. Get y'all ready. And then when you're done, bam. <laughs> That's go. awesome. That's so, my guy to do. See, yeah. that's why I tell people that I don't mess with them if they don't do the perfect bridge. But I get a lot of people that do the bridge, and I'm like, but you didn't pick your toes up, so it's not the perfect bridge. If you can't get your toes up, it doesn't count. See? In my opinion. See? In my opinion. See? Listen so. to him. So, thank you. No, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> oh! Yeah! A serious chat here. I know we were talking about balls earlier, but we're gonna get serious now. All right, so we're gonna talk about the card. So it's been it's been a while, and I was like, I I've been avoiding traffic, so yeah. I haven't come down to each show for a little bit, but I watch every everything. Thanks. So, but this card, I was like, I'm not missing this. Thanks. I'm not missing this. And if you you know, I didn't record this before. Drake Chambers is here. Everybody knows I love freaking Drake Chambers. Awesome. So awesome. shout out to Melissa and Arcadia. <laughs> Melissa loves Drake Chambers. Same, same. Arcadia is the best. Yeah. Much love to him. So tell us a little bit about the card today. Big excited. Uh, biggest match in SHP history. Main event. Two years in the making. Dylan McKay's dream match versus Matt Demoris. I'm beyond excited for that. I know they are too. Matt Demoris coming out of retirement. He wanted two people, Billy Starks and Dylan McKay. And he gets Dylan McKay tonight. Uh, first time ever, Ryan Raddix versus Marcus Mathers. Ryan Raddix undefeated, never been pinned or submitted in SHP. So that's tonight. Uh, Gabe Sky versus Lucky 13. I'm big pumped for that. Big, 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 big excited for it. I'm always excited. I'm definitely excited for tonight. So. <laughs> and I love, and I always say this, and I say it on Twitter and stuff like that. I love when you're out in the crowd enjoying oh. the matches too. That's one of my I biggest love wrestling. things. Wrestling's the best. Yes, and it's one of the biggest things I always say that I love when the wrestlers are out enjoying the show just as much absolutely. as we are. So absolutely, absolutely. So I'm so and excited. And then we're and then we're back in a couple of weeks. You have yes, another two show. Weeks. Exactly two weeks away. SHP and Justice for All Two. Uh, two gold score. Versus the Chad, Ty Hill, Noro Barbwire, Colby Carino versus Joel Bateman, Brandon Kirk versus Matt Tremont, Otis Koga versus Declan Grant. There's a lot of really, really good matches on that card. I'm excited. Yeah, so make sure you're checking out Shaw and Shaw. They're you. always the best. I so. try, I try. Thank you. Good thank, luck today. Thank
You hurt me, Brandon. You hurt me. And now, I'm gonna have to hurt you back.
It's not gonna help anymore. 